Hey, Dave here, and it is Youth Wednesday. The only announcement I have is to keep an eye out for an email that you will receive in the next two to three weeks about how we will be doing confirmation and youth group this coming year. And I know, like in the last few months, um, I have caught up with some TV shows and movies, probably, probably like we all have, and I just recently watched the movie Simon Birch. I have to say that it is one of my favorite movies. If you've seen it, you know why I would say that. Simon Birch is a movie that leaves a lasting impression on you. You see, Simon was born with many medical conditions, plus he was a small person. Even though he was small in stature, his personality was huge. He often gives the local reverend a hard time, you know, with deep, hard theological questions. So what Simon wanted to know is, is there a reason for things? He also wanted to know that God had a plan for his life and a plan for all of us. Well, it turned out that God had, did have plans for Simon. He saved 10 or so of his peers in a bus accident. Now, I realize it was a movie, but in real life, God does have a plan for you and me. Whatever that plan is, my findings has is something to do with helping people. Helping them in ways that help them draw near in their faith with Jesus. Helping and guiding them along the way. And another cool part is, Simon was a hero in this movie, even though he had many problems physically and emotionally, and he still knew he had a purpose, and he went out and did it. Even with our own weaknesses, we can still be a hero for someone. I want to challenge you to step out and try it. Don't let your circumstances get in the way. Let's stay connected. Uh-oh, you're evaluating my work. I am. Are you subscribed? I will with a red button. And give us a thumbs up. I'm a fan. Of course.